audially it will be as exciting as visually and, and style-wise. I mean, there will be so many styles, both of movements and music. So it's sort of like a real festive celebration feeling. It's a lot of catching up meetings and discussion discussions with the choreographers. I like when we have meetings all together, so everybody is kind of like contaminated by each other's energy. I believe that naturally we then create a show that is somehow, somewhere connected. The groups I have chosen are One Youth Dance and Can Do Too. I really liked One Youth because they were just a very strong group of uh, female dancers. I'm always inspired by that. Can Do Too, I just felt a really strong connection with when we were working and I was just very impressed with them, the way they interpreted the choreography. We are going to be looking at themes around Anne Boleyn's life, but I'm also just very interested in mass movement and finding uh, patterns in the space because we're going to have a, such a large stage. I'm going to be working with a fantastic musician called Domenico Angarano and he's going to be composing the piece for us. There's going to be an ensemble of seven musicians which will play live for the piece I'm creating. With Becky, we started working together a few years ago. The last two weeks were intense for me because I had to make sure that all the scores for all the musicians were right, that we had all the cues, and I'm still working on it, so I'm sure the next few days are gonna be even more intense. For the music I write, I tend to go back to my uh, roots. I come from South Italy, and we have a very strong folk tradition. There's people from all over the world in this city, you know, so Having a chance to bring these cultures together is a unique opportunity and I believe that in contemporary dance we can do much about this. So there has been some progression uh, in making the work. I would say it's not quite finished just yet. Actually, we have a lot still to do, but the, what we have done so far, I'm, I'm reasonably happy with. It's been a lot of fun so far working with the two groups, Incognito and Shift. They're both really talented young group of dancers. I'm most looking forward to probably performing in front of a lot of people. I really think this has helped me develop like at the beginning with what I've learned. I think it's a way of expanding my knowledge and our knowledge as a group of Shift about how dance can be in different ways without, without having to stick to a specific style. It's really nice to open your mind and try something new. As of yet, the choreographers haven't had a lot of chance to see each other's work other than in a couple sharings during the uh, intensive workshops. But it has been useful to get to know what everyone's other interests are and what they're making. And I think we are clearly making quite different work, all four of us. It feels like actually next to each other, it won't be such a bizarre thing. <laughs>